Let's be clear, I'm only making this video because I see this all too often. Yeah, I know. We're simplifying these radical expressions, but wait, there's more. I'm over here looking at this, I'm looking at this, I'm looking at this. Can I just reduce that eight and that 64? I'm only making this video because I see this far too often. Can I use that, can I simplify that eight and that 64? Wait, it's a trap! If I have two plus three over two, can I just reduce those twos? No! If I had two times three divided by two, can I reduce those twos? You're feeling a little uncomfortable. I get that. But yes, I can because it's multiplication. I can't because it's addition. So what do I do? Oh, I can split those guys. If I had, if I had, if I had 99 over two plus uh, 77 over two, could I? I could. I could write that 99 plus 77 all over two because they got a common denominator. What's my point? You can split that fraction up into two. Sure. So now I have a 24 root seven all over that common denominator of eight. Wait, great. That's a 64 over eight. Wait, great. All right, now I can reduce. Eight goes into 24 how many times? Well, it's at least two. And then that's a four, that's a 12. Oh, it looks like they could go further. That four, that's a one, you're a three. So now you have three roots of seven minus Age, grades, weight, why? Because 46 divided by 8 is 8, and you do. Ah, box and flower. That was good. Now I'm on up over here. I'm only making this video because I see this far too often. Can I just reduce those tens? Were you not here for the last two minutes? No! Uh, but I can split those into two different fractions. I could say that's a minus 10 divided by 10. Then that's plus the root of 50 over 10. I'm not done. Uh, uh, oh, you are the one. That's not a one. That's a, a fancy one. Oh yeah, dress it up, hat and boots. So that's a minus one plus, whoa, whoa there. That's 25 times two, and 25 is a square, so a five can come out. So that's five root two over 10. Hmm, wonder what Mr. Emery's doing. That's minus one plus, uh, uh, you're two, you're a one. He was like my algebra teacher back in um, high school and um, good times. <laughs> Ooh. Box and flower. Bonus round. So yeah, I see that your book wants a certain answer some type of way. And how do they get that way? They're like, what's in common here in eight? Great, wait. So they pull an eight out and that's three root seven minus eight all over eight. Now this might be a better way. So they reduce and they get this. <laughs> but yeah, I was making that video because I see it just too many times. That's a minus 10 times, or plus 5 root 2 over 10. They're getting you ready for this whole quadratic formula thing. I got a common factor of 5. I pull that out and I get a minus 2 plus uh, root 2 all over 10. Psh. No, that's plus. I just pulled the positive five out and then I reduce that and that's a deuce and that's how I get a minus deuce plus root deuce over deuce. And that's what I get here if I was gonna multiply these guys, I need to multiply that by a two over two and then add, ah, done. We're sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time.